Frequent flyers fly, la 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 la. Frequent flyers bat. What's up? You checking out the Frequent Flyer? Welcome back to the channel. Smash the like button to show your support. If you're new to the channel, I'd like to extend a warm welcome. It's Wacky Wednesday, y'all. <laughs> so I'm back out here at the park. Fly another one of my quads. This time I'm back out here with the Extreme Airwave. This thing is such a little awesome quad. I just wanted to bring this thing out again on a more calm day. So you guys can see how this thing flies because it was a little breeze out here and I was unable to really fly it. So you guys couldn't really see it uh, moving. <laughs> the thing just couldn't move forward with the little breeze that we had out here. And uh, so I did fly it, but it just didn't, uh, I wasn't able to show off its potential and everything. So let's keep this little guy up in the air so we can see how it flies. Guess we'll get to see if this thing holds a charge because I had this thing charged up for two days waiting for a nice day. So let's try to take it up in the air. So we're up with it on low rate. Look at the yaw real quick. <laughs> so pretty decent yaw. This is side flying. Forward flight. Backwards flight. So it flies pretty decent. Let's do a quick flip with it. So flips nice. Does flip backwards and forward. So we're gonna go to the second speed. It only has two speeds. So check it out. Actually get to fly this guy around now. So you guys can see how awesome it looks in the air in flight, moving forward. <laughs> Flies a little faster when it's indoors. Right now, and it is a slight breeze, but it's not too much for it to handle right now. Figure I'll bring this guy out here in the morning when it's not too breezy. The later it gets in the day, the more breezier it gets out here. And so, check this little guy out. Going against the wind there, this is with the wind. Oh, I forgot how small this thing is. Let me bring it in close so you guys can see it. <laughs> Looks awesome. It's flying in the plus configuration. I was thinking about doing a mod to this guy to get rid of the altitude hold. The flight controller is actually on the bottom of the frame when you uh, remove the bottom cover on it the flight controller is right there and then the battery is on top and it's really a small space definitely not enough room to fit like a, a whoop board on there or anything a brushed whoop board will not fit in this guy uh, only other thing I can think of was it has some really small um, beta flight compatible boards that can probably fit in here. Well, we used to have some back in the day. I'm not sure if they're still available on Amazon and all. I felt like doing some <laughs> some proximity, a lot of proximity around these trees with this little guy. And I realized it's so small, I got to come up close so you guys can see me flying around it. <laughs> the range on this little guy seems pretty good dip below the trees the little leaves and branches back around this way <laughs> it banks really nice but it's not that fast so I expect it to be able to bank nicely
back with flip with it. I never did a front with flip. Let's see. Okay, so it does do, it does do front flips. And the battery's not bad, I guess. Because this thing was charged up for at least two days. I think three days. I charged it back up when I had it out last. And I never got to fly it again. And so it's just been sitting there. And it's flying pretty long to have a battery that's just been sitting. You know, I would think that the battery would be, be getting depleted uh, slowly while it's on standby. But this guy is still in the air like a champ. I did a few flips and it's still not blinking on me. Cruising around with this thing. <laughs> Check it out. Oh, there we go with the blink. So not bad at all. And check that out, guys. This thing also alarms when it reaches LVC. So the transmitter here is beeping. So let me know to bring this little guy back in. I'm going to bring it in and try to catch it. And there it is. The Sharper Image Extreme Airwave. Pretty awesome little plus configurator flyer the size of a whoop. Fully protected props and all for indoor flight. You can bump into walls and keep on going with this thing. And it does have altitude hold. So it's really easy for a beginner to fly and you can walk right in Walmart and pick this guy up. Thanks for watching.